Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, NZD here coming with you with a second stimulus check update and what's going on with the second stimulus package and what to look forward to in terms of what should we expect out of the second stimulus package. Now, I know a lot of you probably heard about the HEROES Act. The HEROES Act has passed through the House of Congress and this includes in the package $1,200 payment to each person along with $1,200 for each dependent up to three person, up to three, up to three children. The problem is now is that it's at the Senate and the Senate is not going to actually make any negotiations or make any progress towards it until about the end of July because after 4th of July, they have about a two week recess, which goes from about July 5th until about July 17th. So maybe after they come back from that recess, then we'll probably hear a word from what's going on in the Senate. But in the meantime, the White House is having different ideas of a stimulus package and in fact, with the Republicans in the Senate, the Republicans in the Senate just want a big package of $1 trillion. But right now the president is actually pushing for a package of $2 trillion. So the thing is now is who's going to benefit because it's not saying exactly another stimulus check of $1,200 or another stimulus check of even a stimulus check of $2,000 a month or $2,000 monthly until January, 2021. So it's a lot of debate that's going on on Capitol Hill and especially a lot of discussion is going on in the White House. You have different going back and forth. You have the president that's saying, yes, he supports a generous and dramatic stimulus check. And saying, yes, he supports another round of stimulus check and then expect it to be dramatic and generous. And as well as you have different people such as um, advisor Hassett saying, yes, it's going to be another stimulus check. We just have to wait on Congress and for the president to pass it. So let's go down the line and see what exactly we know about this next package if the package come out and who would benefit from it will you get another twelve hundred dollars out of this benefit so like i said there's different things different ideas that's going on so different people might qualify depending on what kind of stimulus package they put out for example if they put out a stimulus package with um, just that tax break for people who are traveling domestically and you can get up to four thousand uh, dollars tax credit those those people that's gonna benefit are not regular people that's working nine to five or people that just lost their job. They're gonna people that already have money that's that's probably even still working. So we're kind of worried about seeing how that's gonna work out with the system and in the package. Like I said before, McConnell sets for a July deadline for the Senate to decide if they're gonna have a second direct stimulus payment to the US people. They're gonna work on a second stimulus package but actually a phase four of the stimulus package. But then now they're gonna decide, will there be a second round of stimulus check, direct payment stimulus check to people? Because right now we have a recession that's going on. The World Bank right now is saying that, that the US and other banks right now is in the world, right now is in a recession. So definitely, so it definitely be benefit to get some more stimulus payments to the people. One thing that we definitely know is that the HEROES Act passed through the House of Representatives. And the HEROES Act is one form of a proposal that we know definitely uh, people are backing it and that it's like in stone. So let's see, the 1,200 for each person along with 1,200 for each dependent up to uh, three dependents. Then as well, college students will benefit from it and people over the age of 17. Cause before, if you was claimed, before if you was claimed if you before if you was a college student you was claimed on your parents tax return you would not get your twelve hundred dollars in addition to um people who are over 17 um they didn't get uh like so if you're 17 and say you're not even staying at home and stuff like that you wouldn't get a twelve hundred dollars in the heroes act they're working on people who are over 17 people who are in college getting 1200 people who are married to um Legal immigrants should be able to get it. People who are here on, on workers identification should be able to get it. So they're trying to make sure that a lot of people are benefiting, especially since the majority of the population that's affected, um, that affected by the pandemic are people who are in the lower income. As we continue, the second stimulus can help out people. You know, it can help out people with um, who's affected with their income. It can help people who's affected with their bills, with their rent, their mortgage, grocery, groceries have went up. Some people was working, uh, living, some people was living check to check. So if you're living check to check and even have a side hustle or working a, a second job, a lot of people was affected by this. So definitely income was affected. So the second stimulus check is will be helping out people in that condition. So once again, the deadline, we're aiming for them to talk about more about it and 
to set this through the, the Senate and to see if the president will pass off on it is in July. And the president says that we will see something in a couple of weeks. So in about two weeks, he said we should see something. So once again, that's going back into mid-July after, um, I say mid-July after the recess, unless the president is working on something behind the scenes and he's going to push it to the Senate. And then hopefully the Senate will push it through. The House will pass off on it. And then we'll go back and forth and the president will sign off for it. But like we're saying, if there's going to be another stimulus check and a second round of stimulus check, we probably won't see anything until August. Going forward, you know, McConnell only wants $1,000. Um, House of Representatives and the HEROES Act only wants about $3 trillion. The president supports the second round and he wants about $2 trillion because he says he wants this to be even bigger and better before the pandemic and how the economy was going before the, the pandemic. So he wants this to be bigger, better. He wanted to put some into manufacturing and bring in more manufacturing companies and jobs back to the U.S. In addition, he wants to try out the payroll taxes, you know, payroll taxes, reducing on your Social Security and FICA, all those extra stuff it will be reducing. So probably bring you a couple of extra hundred dollars in each month for a regular employee as well as the companies can benefit from it, too. Um, in addition to the tax break and tax credit for people who are doing domestic traveling, that's another big thing that they want to work on, have domestic traveling so you can boost up the traveling industry and you'll be able to get a tax credit. So they're trying to put that in the package. So there's a lot of different things that's going to be trying to go into the next package. They're trying to um, go back and forth. The only bad thing is they're waiting too long to negotiate and to iron these things out because they want to see the numbers. They want to see the job numbers, the unemployment rate and how the economy is going. But right now, the economists are telling them like, we, we need to act now. You don't wait on those job reports because unemployment is going up. And as you can see, the economy is not doing so well. So I'm going to do some more follow-ups on what's going on with the second stimulus check in addition to what's going on with the first stimulus check because I just got some news about, about billions of dollars going to people who are deceased. And right now the SSI haven't even received, some people on SSI haven't even received their stimulus check. So once again, I'm going to do some more follow-ups, some more videos. So if you like this Please like, comment, and share, and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you next time. Be safe. Peace.